we've fallen into this thinking that the big problems of the world must require really, really big solutions, right? That's just, you know, big problems require big answers. But it's not true in the kingdom of God. Some of the biggest problems are actually solved by the most ordinary and simple things you could ever imagine in the kingdom of God. Simple things like just loving your neighbor, just serving your neighbor, just looking after your neighbor, just caring for your neighbor. Our job, again, is not to come up with great big solutions to all the problems of the world. Our job is simply to love our neighbor as ourselves. That's our job. So whose job is it when the neighbor's lawn is overgrown? Do we pick up the phone? Do we call the bylaw department? No, that's, that's our job because we are supposed to love our neighbor as ourselves. Uh, so whose job is it when the mom next door seems to be totally overwhelmed? Whose job is it when the, the senior citizen across the hallway seems to be really lonely? Uh, whose job is it when our neighbor seems to have lost their employment? Uh, who do we call then? Do, do we call the police? Do we call social services? Uh, who are we supposed to call? Who do we tell me? Who we, no, that's our job because we are given the job of loving our neighbors as ourselves. We've become this society all too often that gives the job of caring for our neighbors to somebody else, to some agency, to some government program, or to some charity. We see a problem, we make a phone call. We see a problem, we make a phone call. And surely, yes, there are times when we need to make the phone call. But what if most of the problems of the world could be solved not by getting government to do more, or not by getting charities to do more, but just by getting neighbors to do more. 